Hi guys, so I've had a couple of requests on how to make some of the cardboard toys I show in my videos and um, I did get these ideas from other YouTubers um, a couple of them I got from Chocolate Colours 26 and one or two I think I got from A Rabbit's Life XOXO so um, I didn't invent them or anything, I'm not trying to take credit um, I have just copied them and I've, I'm sure people have done them before but I'm going to show you how I make them. So what I'm going to use to make these toys are some natural paper. Um, brown paper is better than white because white has got bleach and things in to make it that colour so you're better to go for a natural paper. I'm just going to use some toilet roll tubes and cardboard kitchen roll tubes. I'm going to be using some hay some scissors and also some treats and I've got Burgess apple snacks in here. Okay to make the first toy I'm going to make a cardboard dumbbell and I'm going to get my toilet roll tube and flatten it and then I'm just going to get my scissors and cut little strips like this all up there and down that side as well so it's going to look kind of like that and then I'm just going to roll it up like this and these toys are really really simple to make and it will also help keep your guinea pigs teeth down or your rabbits or your hamsters so anything like that and then I'm just going to fold out these sides like this and then you've got a little cardboard dumbbell next I'm going to make another dumbbell kind of toy and I'm just going to do the same but cut up here like this and go all the way around and all the way back but you don't want them to join in the middle because then it will just fall in half and then that should look like that and then all I do is push out these sides like this and there's another type of dumbbell thing you can make and um, I find that my guinea pigs and rabbits especially really like nibbling these edges and it just makes it a little bit more exciting for them than giving them a toilet roll tube so there's another idea you can use you can also use the same sort of idea to make different shapes and toys for them like a little palm tree for the next toy I'm going to show you I'm going to use another toilet roll tube and just flatten it like that and then I'm going to cut strips about that wide all along it so I'm left with different bits like this and then I'm just gonna thread them into each other like this and it should make <laughs> like a little pocket and oh, and then in there you can poke some treats um, for the hamsters I use mealworms and for the guinea pigs I use the apple snacks and then they'll smell it inside and they'll chew it to try and get them out so that's another really good way of encouraging them to keep their teeth down for this one I'm just going to use a kitchen roll tube but you can also use a toilet roll tube and I'm going to use my paper and what I'm first going to do is stuff this with hay. Sometimes I do just give them this because they do need a large percent of their diet to be hay. So this just makes it a bit more exciting for them rather than just eating it out of a hay rack every day. But um, for this one I'm going to actually wrap it up in the paper. I'm also going to put a few little treats in the end just to give them a bit more of an incentive to try and get them out. And now I'm just going to wrap it in the paper like this. So I've wrapped it up in the paper and now I'm just going to twist the end to stop it all falling out and make it a bit harder for them to get in. You can also use a paper bag or I'm just going to use this bit of paper and use the same idea just to put some hay and some treats inside to make it a little bit more exciting for them 
and they'll have a lot of fun trying to get it out. And I'm just going to tie it all together at the top here with some natural string just so it holds in all the hay. So here are just a couple of ideas of DIY treats and toys to keep your animals chewing which is really important especially with small animals like guinea pigs. <laughs> um, these ones are going to be a bit messy though which makes their cage really really dirty but there we go if you've got any ideas yourself or you've made any toys then I'd be oh I'd love to see them if you could leave them as a video response but here's just a couple ideas on how to keep your animals chewing for free Hi. <laughs> you licking my leg? <laughs> oh. Oh, won't she let you play? <laughs> <laughs> 